Hello mga kaguro, this is Sergio, your partner in guide and troubleshooting and working out with your documents. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to activate expired Microsoft Office 2013 and 2016 using the Microsoft Office Activator. So, ipapakita ko po sa inyo guys kung ano ang mangyayari kapag expired yung Microsoft Office nyo. So, right in this part, we have here, I believe, Microsoft Office 2016. And it shows right here on top, Word and License Product. And then if you can see right here, Account, the Office 2016, okay, View Only and License. Meaning to say that you can't open or make any document here using this expired Microsoft Office. So if we're going to try here to click New, it doesn't let us create a document. So the only option here is Home and then if we're going to click New, so it shows here activate and if we're going to type here we can type any word here and the options on top are on gray um, setting meaning to say you can choose any options here to click since it's expired and it's showing it right here use free at office.com and if you're going to activate this one using the activator of Microsoft Office definitely you're going to pay for it but here with our activator we can activate this one offline you don't need to connect to the internet and it gives you uh, free um, access with your Microsoft Office for six months and after it expire so you're going to reactivate it again using this offline activator so what we're going to do here is to turn off the antivirus first because our activator is being scanned by the Windows security antivirus and then they detected this one as virus since it's not registered in any Microsoft uh, corporation so what we're going to do here is to go to the settings of your um, Windows security and then go to manage settings and then turn off the real-time protection we're going to turn it back on after we activated your uh, Microsoft Office and then here just close this one so everything here in this uh, part is turned off so we have to minimize this one and we have to open our activator here I just save this one here in my local disk D and I have here activators so what we're going to use is the RA1 activator okay so what happened right here the activator that we have in this folder uh, was being scanned and deleted automatically by the antivirus before we turned off the, the antivirus so what we're going to do is to find the um, RAR of this antivirus and then we have to extract this one again okay um, so yes to all and then let's open it again so it's already here so don't forget to have a rare copy of this um, activator because every time you have to put your USB or your hard drive to a laptop where you save this and this activator and if the antivirus of our laptop is turned on it automatically scanned and delete the activator that we have here in our device so don't forget to have a rare copy of this um, activator so that if ever that the built-in antivirus of our laptop deleted this activator we can definitely uh, restore it again by um, extracting the rare files into a folder so we have to open this now and click this one right click and then run as administrator and click yes uh, anyway guys this activator also activates expired windows not only expired microsoft office all right uh right at this time mga kaguro, if we're going to check here since we will be activating the microsoft office so we will activate office using office kms activation so using your keyboard just move all the way down to office kms activation All right, so if the Office KMS activation is highlighted, so we were going to click to enter in our keyboard. Okay, so if you're going to observe here, mga kaguro, it's attempting to clean KMS servers, and it will go to start activating the Microsoft Office for the period of six months. Okay, just stay on the line, ng po, mga kaguro. Alright, attempting to start KMS R at 1. 
and successful. So it's already injected the KMS R at one activator. So make sure lang po that you have disabled your antivirus because our antivirus will going to restrict this activator to run and, and it will not allow us to activate our Microsoft Office because Microsoft Office or Microsoft company a program uh, had a program to to um, monitor or scan any application that will try to activate their uh, programs and if that kind of application is not uh, licensed and not um, affiliated in their company definitely it will be deleted by the antivirus so we have to turn off the antivirus first before we were going to run this activation process and if you're going to check here activation successful our remaining period 180 days so after the activation uh, time is finished so we will going to reactivate it again using this offline activator so what we're going to do here is to check if our program is already activated so right at this time it says unlicensed product so we're going to close this one first because uh, we have to refresh our Microsoft Office so let's try first with Microsoft Word okay so if you're going to check now mga kaguro, um, it doesn't have any unlicensed word on top okay before after we have opened it did show right there on top but now it is not present anymore it's already um, erased or something like that so let's go in account and here in the account option office product activated Microsoft Office professional plus 2016 is now activated and we can definitely use this uh, Microsoft Office program and we can type uh, whatever word we wanted to type in here and we can save also for free before we're going to check here um, before we activated this office uh, program it it has a color gray um, line here on top that means that uh, we cannot do anything here on top we cannot edit or we can um, click here because it's not activated so let's try to open some of the Microsoft Office program so let's try Microsoft Publisher so first it has a unlicensed product and then it disappear just like a magic because the activator is already running inside of this laptop that we have and then automatically activated this office for the period of six months and click here the account and it did show Microsoft Office activated so this product contains all of this um, Microsoft Office programs and all of this one are already activated by our offline activator so we call it offline because we don't have internet connection here if you're going to click here we don't have any internet connection so here we did we don't have any connection for that but we was able to activate the Microsoft programs so let's try Excel alright Excel is already activated so let's click here on the account so it's very effective guys and the very important program that we use is Microsoft PowerPoint and let's check here on the account option and then it says activated so all of the four major Microsoft Office program we have in our laptop is already activated using with this offline activator and it could run for free it doesn't need internet connection and it could also activate expired Windows how do we know that our Windows is expired so you can go ahead and, and click for settings and then search for activation or something like that so um, some of the keyboard here in this laptop is not working but you can go ahead and check using your your um, laptop and see if your uh, if the Windows is activated or not so this time the Windows is still activated so we have already solved the problem of this um, laptop and we have activated the four major uh, Microsoft Office program and some of the Microsoft Office program that we have just like uh, Office OneNote or Outlook is also activated. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully that this video helps you. And if you really wanted to have a copy of this kind of activator, uh, feel free to message me on the comment box and put your email so that we can send you with this kind of activator. Thank you so much and have a great day.